Shotgun Riding with Mike Goodman to Del Popolos. What's up, Internet? Welcome to Handle It. I'm Harley, a.k.a. The Sauce Boss, a.k.a. The Jeff Goldblum of Jamaican Jerk Chicken. Today, we are filming an episode of Handle It. My name is Harley. <laughs> shut up. You shut up. I, I would call it Jamaican bagels or island bagels. Island, oh, Jamaican island, island, island bagels. <laughs> By the beach bagels. Bad gal bagels. <laughs> Bad gal bagel is so good. <laughs> Why am I not laughing at that one? <laughs> Why am I not laughing at that one? <laughs> Bad gal bagel. Oh. Making bagel. Kaboom! We'll figure it out. Okay, step one, get yourself a nice area. Two bowls over here. It's got two bowls. My wet bowl, my dry bowl. But don't be fooled. Yeast, this powder over here, it's still a, it's still a wet ingredient. It's part of team wet disguised. It's like a scout. It's like a scout class. That, that, that lens got a little dusty there. Look at those guys. The spy disguised as a dry ingredient, creeping into the wet ingredients, you know what I mean? We got our bowl of wet ingredients, our bowl of dry ingredients, and we're gonna assimilate them. Um, make sure your yeast is activated. It should be milky looking. A little bit of dry ingredients in there. Mix it around. Just mixing this up, mixing the dough together. All right, once you got your dough formed, just put a towel over the bowl and set it aside for 30 minutes. Let that dough rise. We got the pan chilling right now on max heat. Tossing these bad boys in here. Onions, peppers, green onions. Should I have some garlic? Smell it. You can't, you're a camera. I could smell it though. Real garlic. Get it in there and over here some oil. Wooden spoon. Love the wooden spoon. Pass that garlic around. Pass that garlic around for the whole team. Let the whole team get some garlic. Throw the beef in there first. Careful that oil splash. We got our beef in there, we got our vegetables in there. Our curry powder, allspice, a little bit of thyme, salt and pepper, all of your boy. And now let's just make sure it gets spread all over. See that? That's that jerk, boy. Let's get it. And try and catch the jerk in like the juices and then use the juices to spread the jerk. Let's get these breadcrumbs in there. That's a nice smell, eh? It's looking a little dry. I want it to be a bit of a pastier texture, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of water here. This way it'll It'll bind better. That dough's looking good. Got this dough over here. We're gonna wanna roll this out to about half an inch thick. That's what we wanna do here, okay? So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna cut this in strips right now. Now this one that I'm cutting right now is not an ideal strip. Forget this guy. I mean, but don't forget him. I mean, I'm not forgetting him. I'm gonna make use of him. But that's not an ideal strip. This is what an ideal strip would be. Because um, the plan is we're gonna be putting the Jamaican patty style beef <laughs> mixture into this bagel. So it's gonna be laid out on top of this. So this is the landing strip for our Jamaican beef. We got our strips over here for our bagels. Got a little bit of jerk. That laying it out, just like that. Guys, be cautious. You don't want your strips sticking to your table. So make sure it's sufficiently powdered. You wanna egg wash the sides, guys. So you see what he did here? He uh, squished it all together so he's got a runway on either side. He egg washed those sides and he's gonna use that as the glue to roll it up like it's literally a zigzag. See if I don't clear these guys out of the runway, they get they get tagged up with that egg wash. Clear yourself a big space so you can get creative. Look at this. This has literally become my canvas now. Make sure it's all sealed up here. I see some loose sections. You want it. You want it tight. You want it tight. I'm playing around. All right. So we got our water boiling over here. I got some honey gonna be putting this honey into the water. So check it out, I transported the bagels from over there to the pot, but I want you to see, I had to flour the surface of this. All right, I, I did it on the island, maybe you did it on your transport tray, but flour it up, because you don't want them getting to this stage and then sticking to your tray or whatever, you know, in transport, it'd be really dumb. Now you wanna boil these bad boys for about a minute each side. So we got our bagels all boiled now. They're looking ready for this sesame seeding process. I mean, do this however you want. Like it doesn't, like it's, sesame seeds could be random or they could be done in a way that shows you maybe give it more than I do. 
475 degrees Fahrenheit, 15 to 20 minutes. That's how long the bagels are gonna take. You can keep an eye on them if you want. I live a little risky. I'm gonna come check them out in 21 minutes. All right, guys, we did it. We have created a bagel tribute to the Jamaican patty. That's right, still haven't figured out what I'm gonna call it. Regardless, it smells delicious. It smells spicy, it smells good. I hope you followed these steps along the way. I mean, you don't need to put the Jamaican seasoned beef inside there. You could switch it up with whatever you want. I mean, it, it, it's cooking, follow your heart. You create your own destiny. Do whatever it is that you wanna do. We just gave you a little guideline here. You know, We showed you the path, you're the one that walks it. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for following along. Hit the like button. It's really fucking important. You hit the like button. Please fucking hit it. The like button. Leave us a comment. I read every single one of them. Share the video if you want and subscribe because we got new recipes every week, new epic meals every week, fun random shit as well along the way. So hit that subscribe button. Make it happen. Also next to the subscribe button, there's a little bell. If you hit that, you actually get text messages when videos go up then you could be first comment like that and I get to see it and be like, oh my God, this guy's so fast. How do you get so fast? Okay.